Okay. I'd like to call to order the 75th meeting of the National Advisory Council for Human Genome Research. Uh, welcome, everybody. It's good to see you all. Um, I'll turn this over to Rudy. Okay. Good morning, everyone. Let me uh, begin by reminding you that the open session of Council is uh, videocast live with minimal delay and archived. So the URL will be available for your mothers um, at, uh, at the end of the meeting. Uh, we're going to start by welcoming our council liaison, uh, Ellen Giarelli from the International Society of Nurses and Genetics, Joe McInerney from the American Society of Human Genetics, James O'Leary from the Genetic Alliance, Rhonda Schoenberg from the National Society of Genetic Counselors, and Judith Beckendorf for the American College of Medical Genetics and Genomics. Thank you all for spending the day with us today. Uh, we have a number of new staff members to introduce to the Council. Uh, every summer, the extramural research program turns over about half of the program analyst position, so we have several people to introduce. When I call your name, would you please stand so the Council uh, can identify you? Uh, Kachina Bossett. Uh, Kachina has a Bachelor of Science degree in Health Science and Public Health and is currently working towards her Master's degree in Life Science. She comes to us from NIAMS where she provided support, for support services for intramural investigators there. Uh, she is the Scientific Program Analyst in the Division of Extramural Operations. She works on data access requests submitted by the extramural investigators and she also provides support to the review branch. Colette Fletcher Hoppy. Colette is a recent graduate of Vassar College where she obtained a BA in biology and an associate's degree in history. Colette is involved in protein capture, IGNITE, and functional variation grants. Thank you, Colette. Kevin Lee. Kevin is also a graduate of Vassar College. He has an undergraduate degree in biology and a minor in mathematics. Uh, Kevin will be supporting the genome sequencing program and uh, bioinformatics portfolio of grants as well. Elian Silverman. Elian graduated from Grinnell College in Iowa, and she has prior experience doing scientific administrative work via several summer internships at the National Science Foundation. Elian supports the uh, 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 TCGA and CSER projects and the Genomic Medicine Working Group of Council. Thank you, Elian. Laura Scow. Laura graduated from Pomona College with a BA degree in neuroscience. She has experience working in science education and outreach programs for underserved communities. Laura works on the H3 Africa Common Fund program. Kira Wong. Kira is a recent graduate from Swarthmore College. She earned a degree in biology and minored in English Lit. Kira works on Emerge and ClinGen. Thank you, Kira. We have uh, several new staff in the Division of Policy, Communications, and Education, or DPCE, to you, Genomic Conoscenti. Uh, John Ohab. Uh, John is the new Chief of the Communications and Public Liaison Branch. Before coming to NHGRI, Dr. Ohab worked at the Naval Research Laboratory where he served as the head of communications and social media. He has also been involved in the development of new commu communication strategies for the Department of, of Defense and several new startups. Uh, this is not John's first time at NIH. Um, several years ago, he was a AAA fellow uh, uh, and he served as a policy analyst at NIMH. So welcome back to NIH, John. Christina Capusti. Christina is a new senior po health policy analyst working in the policy and program analysis branch. Christina has a master's degree in biotechnology from Georgetown University, and before coming to NHGRI, she worked as a program manager for one of NHGRI's IGNITE grantees at the University of California, San Francisco. Kelsey Stastrom. Kelsey is the new special assistant and program analyst to Laura Rodriguez. Kelsey is a recent graduate from Georgetown University with a master's degree in biomedical science, policy, and advocacy. Kelsey will support scientific and policy-based in initiatives performed across DPCE. 
Donna Messer Smith Jones. Say again. Oh dear, too bad. Um, well, Donna uh, is a, a science program analyst in genomic healthcare branch of DPCE. Donna works on a number of genomic education projects for health professionals, including the Genetics Genomics Competency Center, or G2C2. Emily Never. <coughs> Emily is the chief of the Management Analysis and Workforce Development Branch. Before coming to NHGRI, Emily worked at the National Institutes of Mental Health as the chief of the ethics branch. Thank you. Rebecca Hong. Rebecca is a recent graduate of Georgetown University School of Foreign Service, and she is a program analyst working in the policy and program analysis branch of DPCE. Rebecca will be working on congressional reporting, legislation tracking, and NHGRI's messaging efforts. Thank you, Rebecca. And Michael Hahn. Uh, Michael is a scientific program analyst who is working with Vince Bonham, and Vince, of course, is the advisor to the director on genomics and health disparities in the office of the director. Thank you. Uh, that's it for the new staff. I think we'll have a quiz at lunch and see how many of you can remember their names. Okay, uh, I seek approval of the May Council Minutes. There's a copy that was put into the Electronic Council Book. Are there any comments or corrections that the Council wishes to make to the May Minutes? All right, can I have a, a motion to accept the minutes or approve them? And a second. All in favor? Any opposed? Any abstaining? Thank you. Uh, on the open session agenda, let me draw your attention to the next six council meeting dates. If any of you note a conflict with your schedule, uh, please notify me and more, more importantly notify Comfort Brown uh, so we can uh, help you work around that. And uh, with that, I'm going to turn things over to Eric for the director's report.